I'm so happy for you. I heard your punishment from Shadis is finally over and that you've gotten your meal privileges back. You must be excited. Oh. That's unfortunate. I'm sorry to hear that they're cutting your rations for a while to make sure you're not sending your food to anyone else. Really? Oh, that's a relief. I'm glad your family has a stable enough income that they can sustain themselves without you getting in trouble again. Um, listen. Could I tell you something? Look, um, I may or may not have broken the rules again. I know, I know, it's a really bad habit, and I am trying to break it, I promise, but, well, I just couldn't help it this time. My family, we were hunters. We had to track animals and find ways to trap and kill them. I noticed some tracks in the woods the other day when we were training with the ODM gear. They were rabbit's prints. And they were relatively fresh, so I snuck off while Shadis was focusing on the others and I found them. Oh, no, 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 no. There weren't, there weren't any, any children. There weren't any, um, baby rabbits. No, no. No need to worry about that. My family were hunters, not savages. We don't kill young lives. Just the ones that have served their purpose and can serve new ones now. But I did kill two good-sized ones, and there's enough meat to feed you and your family if you'd like to send some to them. I know that ever since we lost Walmaria, meat has been very hard to find. And when you could find it, Someone was selling it, and it was way too expensive for any normal person to afford. But I've cured it, so you can send it to your family, and they can store it for a while if they need to. And you can hold on to it for a little while if you're not ready to eat it just now. And it's all for you, I promise. I didn't take any of it. And I did uh, skin them since you kind of have to, since humans can't digest fur very well. And I heard that your family recently had another child. So, uh, to kind of help out, I guess, I made some warmer clothing out of the rabbit's fur. It's a sign of respect to use every part of the animal to its fullest use. <sighs> yeah, I'm sorry if that's a little bit odd. I... You're... You're just a... a really good friend, and... I wanted to thank you somehow for being so kind to me. Not only that, but... I know what it's like to have a family that's struggling to get by. And... 
I don't want your family to have to change unnecessarily. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I'll try not to do it again, but really, it was worth it. The smile on your face. It, it just makes my day, you know? You know how when you have someone who's really close to you and you manage to make them smile and it just... It can make you feel better, even if you weren't feeling all that down. I don't know, that... That might not have happened to you before. I don't know. Huh? No. No, 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 no. That, that's for you. Just for you. And your family, if you want to share with them. Really, I'm fine without it. Hmm? Okay. What's the compromise? Okay. So if I continue to supply you with food for your family, well, mainly meat, then you'll share some with me? That's really sweet of you to offer. But I have to decline. I'll still continue to get meat for you if you want. It's very rare within the walls and no offense, but you could definitely stand to gain more protein than what the vegetables give you. Yeah, meat actually provides all essential amino acids, which is really, really good for you. It can help with your immune system, with your muscle contractions, so that you can move, and in our line of work, that would probably be useful, don't you think? <laughs> yeah, my father taught me that a long time ago. I used to not want to kill the animals to get food. But... The way he said it, the way he explained it, it was actually very nice. He said that it was like they were being given a new purpose, and that we should be grateful for their sacrifice. Uh. Sorry, I got a little lost in thought there. Really, though, I'm happy to help you and your family. You're a very good person. And with the world we live in, I think it's important that you and Everyone else has someone that they can rely on to help them. And if you'll let me, I think I'd like to be that person for you. Yeah. I'm happy to help. Besides, I'm sneaky enough in the forest that I don't think anyone will ever catch me. Believe me, I know the woods like the back of my hand. Oh wait, that mark's new. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> mm. 
The forest is much different from the barracks and all the buildings here. There's a certain grace one has to possess in order to truly understand it. My father taught me how to earn that grace in a sense. He taught me how to find my way if I ever got lost, how to track, how to hunt. So you can take it as a guarantee when I say that I'm smarter than your average potato. <laughs> you have such a nice laugh. I don't know why I said that, but is that an odd thing to say? I mean, I've heard people say it before, but I'm not really sure if that is something people normally say. Oh good, I didn't want to weird you out any more than I already had. <laughs> um... Hey, um, could I ask you a favor, though? No, no, it's nothing that'll get you in trouble. I wouldn't do that to my best friend. Of course you're my best friend. You're nice to me. You care about my feelings. You include me in conversations even when I don't understand the topic. And when that does happen, you help me to understand it. Which is why I may or may not need your help studying for the test that's tomorrow. Well, I tried getting Jean or Armin to explain it, or even Mikasa or Annie, but they aren't you. Annie and Mikasa it's very difficult to listen to a monotone for hours on end. Jean, very irritating, constantly asking me about Mikasa. And Armin, very kind, but an extremely advanced vocabulary that I cannot understand no matter how hard I try. But every time you explain something to me, I can somehow understand it immediately. So, do you think you could lend me a hand? <laughs> Thanks. And I don't need help with much, really. Just, uh, the entire chapter. <laughs> <laughs>